Hi, Dr. Elizabeth here today talking about three ways to use essential oils. So the first thing I'm concerned with is safety. If you're going to be using essential oils, make sure you're using the very highest quality and the very highest tested grade. What I recommend is doTERRA essential oils because they're the only certified pure tested grade oils on the market. They don't have any synthetics and they're distilled from the very highest quality plants with great farming practices behind them. So please use doTERRA. And if you wanna learn more about that, I can certainly tell you more. So three ways to use them. The first way, and probably the simplest way to use them, is aromatically. This is what comes to mind for most people with using essential oils. So this is a great way to set the mood of a room and also a great way to just perk yourself up or relax yourself if you need a moment like that. So as you can see, I have a diffuser going right here. This is probably the most common way to use oils aromatically. And you can do anything from setting yourself into work mode, like with rosemary and peppermint, or into relax mode with something like adaptive or wild orange, or abundance mode with just some wild orange and some grapefruit maybe. Um, citrus oils are super happy. So you can put those in your diffuser. There are all kinds of diffuser blends that I can share with you. And doTERRA has many pre-made blends for specific things such as peace or forgiveness or joy, passion. Um, I would love to tell you more about that. Another way that I like to use them aromatically is just by opening the bottle and smelling it. So I'm smelling Balance Oil right now, which is the grounding blend and a blend that if ever you have any stress, this is one you want to have on hand. Um, using oils aromatically is a great way to use them around your family, around pets, because it's very non-invasive. You can just set the tone for the whole room and um, everyone can benefit that way. The second way to use essential oils is topically. So topically means on your skin. Now, topically can be used for a couple different reasons. Again, it can be used to shift your mood. So I often use balance right here on the pulse points on my wrists, rub it together, and just breathe it in. And that helps me just relax and shift my mood to a better place throughout the day. Um, you can also use them topically for specific things, like if you get bug bites or sunburn, you can use some lavender topically. If you have some muscle pain, you can use something like the deep blue rub. And if you want to use oils for anti-aging purposes, there are some great blends that include stuff like frankincense and lavender. Um, they're also a great antiseptic oil. Um, frankincense and lavender are two of those. Tea tree and cedar wood are wonderful for that too. So many of these come in pre-made blends or you can blend your own. When you're using oils topically, what I recommend, so you'll get the most benefit and make your oils go the furthest, is to dilute them with, with a carrier oil. So the most commonly used one is fractionated coconut oil and doTERRA sells this on your website so you can get it through your wholesale account. You can also use kind of whatever oil you have though. I like jojoba oil or avocado oil too. Those are really nice. So what you wanna do is dilute. Um, so how I do it often, is I will put a drop of oil in my hand and then add a couple drops of the carrier oil and then rub it into whatever body part I wanna rub it into. If I have, like I have a big bruise right now, so I rub some deep blue oil into that along with some fractionated coconut oil. Another thing that doTERRA does that makes it really simple is they make roller balls. So these are, they have a little roller, so you can roll them right on your skin and they're already diluted with coconut oil, so you don't have to mess around with pouring the oils out. This one is past tense, amazing for headaches and muscle tension, particularly in the neck and shoulders. Um, and there are a lot of them. So you can use oils topically for many different ailments. My daughter's favorite thing to do is make a little roller ball of lavender. They also sell them pre-made. And she carries this around with her in the summer because she's very prone to mosquito bites and they, it takes the itch away right away. Topically is a great way to use oils. 
the most life-changing me for me way for me is probably internally um, so I know I know you're you've probably been told to not use oils internally why that is is because pretty much all the oils on the market are synthetic and you don't want to take those internally you don't want to use them on your skin either or breathe them in um, breathing them in goes right to your brain using them on the skin goes right into your bloodstream taking them internally goes into your digestive system so a few ways that I use mine internally are in my water. I always have oils in my water, usually citrus oils or some blend, including citrus, because citrus oils are delicious. My favorite lately is green mandarin, yum. And then another way I use them is in the doTERRA supplements. So this is the Lifelong Vitality Pack, which was completely life-changing for me. 35 years of chronic pain and fibromyalgia gone within a month of using these. They have some essential oils in them and a lot of greens and some um, omega oils and completely life-changing. You can also take oils directly under your tongue. Um, frankincense is a really common one to use that way. Frankincense is um, good for pretty much everything you can imagine. The list of things it's a remedy for, it would take another five minutes to read the whole list. So if you have more questions about that or ways to use oils safely, I would love to set up a free consult with you. So you can do that right here on my website and I will look forward to talking with you soon.